Say hello to everybody. Hello, everybody. Come on, mommy. <laughs> Probably really late on this. I got the viral tote bags from TikTok shop. I got two of them. I think these are called the everything tote. Apparently you're supposed to be able to fit so many things in here. Shipping took a week. It was way faster than I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to take longer because a lot of packages I got from China took like a month. Shipping was free. I paid a total of $9 for both bags, which isn't bad at all. I thought I'd do a full on review of what I think of it because most of the videos I saw were sponsored and I just want to give you my honest review. Let me start off by saying I never really wanted to order from the TikTok shop. I've always been really skeptical. I have trust issues, but I kept seeing this on my feed and I'm like, you know what? I'm not going to get it. I'm not going to get it. And then I got it. I'm really late on this trend though. It don't matter. I picked out this cream white one. I thought it was so cute. It's not bright white. I don't really know how you would describe this. I know there's a color in mine. I just can't think of it. It's like a cream, tan, white kind of look, but it's not too dark. The leather parts are this pink color, and I really like this pink color. It's like a, a nude, dusty pink, sort of. This is what the inside looks like. It comes with this extra strap to attach to the sides of the bags and it comes with this thing for the bottom. It does feel kind of thick. The texture on the outside feels thick, but this bag is pretty flimsy as you can see. I don't think it'll be a problem for when you actually put things in it. Next up, I'll open the pink one. This one I liked because it wasn't a bright pink. It's more like a muted pink, but it's also pretty vibrant. This is honestly the color of my room. My favorite pink. It's so pretty. I attached the straps of these right here so you, you could see how they looked. I feel like the white one goes with more outfits and the pink one goes with my pink outfits. Cute. Cute. When I first got the package and opened it, it smelled weird like fish. And I didn't think much of it, but as soon as I opened the little plastic bag that came in, it was a very, 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 very strong smell. Let's keep that in mind for when you get it. I didn't really hear anybody say it when they reviewed it. If you're like sensitive to certain smells, you have a little heads up. I'll just fill this up with some random books and see how it holds up. And first book we're going to put in there, things we never got over. Aesthetic stuff. All right. One book makes it look nice and held up together. It's getting kind of heavy. You could fit some stuff in here too. In this pocket. My arms are low-key getting tired from carrying this. I'm just really weak. Perfect. Like that. And we'll put this little dude in there for the aesthetic. Cute! It does fit a lot of things. It was pretty durable so far. The more I use it, that's when I can determine how durable it is. Since this is just a one-time use right now. I forgot to mention how they look in real life compared to what I saw in the photo. I was afraid that it wasn't going to look the way it looked in the photo. Color-wise, because I know sometimes things look different online they do look exactly like what i saw which i am super happy with i'll actually have the colors on the screen so you can see what i saw and what i have here overall i think they're super cute i'll probably make another video in a month or so to see how well they hold up after being used and i'll probably film like from time to time showing you guys how they look with different outfits as well as any wear and tear that i might have seen thank you for watching be sure to stay tuned for part two and subscribe if you want to be part of the fam bye now